fucker, you have nothing outside of streaming. How do you know what the fuck he has and what he doesn't? You know he sells jerseys. You know he sells merch. One, no one was buying that merch. Most of the designs were just ugly. Or either that, it arrived like, what, a month late for people? And people were wondering when they got their jerseys or hats. This dude wasted so much money on merch just for no one to buy it. If I'm not wrong, did someone had to buy like the rest of LTG's towels that no one bought just because he felt bad for him? The merch was a fail, dude. Bro, for all you know, he could be selling steroids in the gym or have a side hustle. You if he was actually doing that, I'm pretty sure some troll would have found that out quickly. No, no. Like, this is it for you, bro. Like, th like, this is it. So when you try to flex that you're doing some big power moves, like, on some, like, on some alpha male business LLCs and real estate, come on, bro. Like, yo, what, what you're doing is just streaming for pay pigs, man. <laughs> he has over a hundred grand saved up that he was going to use to buy a house. I mean, that would be tough if he actually had that, but I highly doubt that he does. You're talking a lot of shit, bro. And, yo, don't take it personally, but he's more alpha male than you. Yeah, I don't think alpha males, you know, make fun of people with disabilities or make fun of a veterinarian's suicide or, you know, be transphobic, racist. Yeah. And you know it, dog. You're not more alpha male than low tier, God. Get the fuck out of here. That's exactly what you're doing. Just keep a, just call a spade a spade. Just say just say the fact that, bro, I need the stream because I need money. Might as well. Why do you need him to tell you that? Why does he have to say what you want him to say? Like for you, like what are you gonna stop restreaming if he admits he needs the money to pay rent, bro? Like, I mean, he has that hundred grand you're talking about, right? I'm pretty sure that would be a problem for him. He wouldn't have the stream anymore. Please stop the cock munching. Who the fuck do you think you are? Well, just tell your supporters, bro. Like, I need your money. Please pay me because I need your money. Might as well just say that. I'll have more respect for you if you just say that. I'll have more respect for you if you oh say that. God. Look, man, I'm sh Look, man, he doesn't need your respect. He doesn't need the respect of any troll. Bro, he's been doing this shit for almost 10 years. He's been getting trolled. You know what I'm saying? And then now you're going to restream his shit, make 50, 60 bucks a stream, a restream. And for what? You're going to waste mad hours of your life doing that shit. I've already seen a lot of trolls come and go, bro. You got Demi God moved on with his life. LX Dark Sniper moved on with his life. It's funny how you label the people who he started to beef with. Low tier vault rep moved on with his life. Joshua Cornstar moved on. Trevor Belmont moved on. Foxy Sphinx moved on. Those guys still upload troll content to this day, actually. Or Sheen Sniper. And now you're the new clown. You're the new restreamer, just like Bender, restreaming LTG and then thinking that shit's gonna last. Come on, bro. Like. Why are you even so excited and you're so happy and you're laughing so much that he got that a man lost his income? But does he not have that 100k though? Do you know what it's like to pay your own bills, dog, and not live off your parents and shit? According to you, you know, this could be their side hustle. You, you, you don't know. And if you do know so, if you know what that life is here in America, then why the fuck would you be laughing and super happy that this dude lost his bread? Why? Are you well, I don't know the dog scene, the Ronnie McNutt incident, the Broly Legs incident, the Cereal Blast incident, the slurs, and you're seriously sitting here wondering why people are happy that he lost his channel? He literally does not deserve to have a platform. He's lucky to have a platform. He's so excited that low tier God lost his money. You know what I'm saying? He fucking entertains you guys and gives you guys shit to clip for fucking years, bro. What other low cow has entertained you as much as Dale? Go watch fucking DSP or Wings of Redemption and tell me that's not the most boring shit ever. At least low tier God rages and makes you guys, you know, he, he entertains you guys. 
I don't even watch low tier God that much. Maybe like three or four times a year, I'll watch them for like a month or some shit. Like out of a whole year, I'll watch them for like two or three months. Ran. Now that's that's fucking cap. That is so. I'll spend you know a few days watching a Nikolai re-upload or some shit. Wait a minute, you complain about trolls, but yet watch their content. Not to mention. Nicola is like the main character for the trolls, and Dale would literally ban you for saying this, by the way. Whatever. A compilation. That shit's funny. It's entertaining. I'll watch it while I break at work. But, like, to be obsessed on and be on his dick fucking every day and just waiting for him to go live so you can restream and you're super hot. Like, bro, he got banned off YouTube. Get off his nuts, bro. What more do you guys want? To troll and make content. That's it. Didn't you want him banned from YouTube? He got banned from YouTube. And then you guys keep going and going. And it's like, bro, let's say he does quit streaming. Let's say he takes his own life. What the fuck are you guys going to do next? Who, who's the next victim? There's no next victim. The fuck? What, what's the next cancel culture movement that you guys are going to attack? Because apparently a black guy that speaks his mind and is in good shape is a threat to you niggas. That shit drives you guys crazy. That shit triggers you. Wow, how can someone have so much confidence and talk so much shit and make money, make a living off streaming? Fuck, that needs to be me, bro. Does he not hate on other black guys? You know, black guys are more successful than him. I mean, was he not just hating on your rage? So I need I need to assassinate this dude's character because I don't got nothing else to do. He assassinates his own character. That's crazy to me, bro. You guys are fuck. You guys need to go get put on Seroquel. You guys need antipsychotics, fucking benzos. You guys need to be put on all sorts of shit. All you niggas need to be on disability. You guys are nuts, bro. Yeah, and that's basically the end of the video. And I'm just going to say one simple thing. If situations like the Ronnie McNutt situation still doesn't convince that LTG is a bad person, I don't know what will. See ya.